everything collapses, is reducible to lights, circles, blurred geometry, spotty shades, iridescent nothings. She started speaking over me, and I didn't really know what to do, but it kind of, yeah, it was scary, kind of. And then she just said, speak. Well, that that presupposes that you subscribe to the notion that what you perceive is your reality. You know, when in fact, reality is more than what we're able to perceive. You know, like in those horror movies when you have the monster walking around looking at things with heat vision. He is seeing a different form of reality that we that we can't experience with our senses. We see light on a certain spectrum, and he's seeing it on you know the infrared spectrum. And what is perceived as reality for him is different than what is perceived reality for us. The sharp specificities become distorted, shifting colors as if obscured by water. And she said, just open your mouth. And I couldn't, I just, my throat caught, and I just started crying. You know, every object emits energy on the electromagnetic spectrum, and we're only capable of capturing a, a portion of it with our visual system. We only perceive the, the visible light, and there's a whole other world out there of infrared light on this spectrum that we're not privy to with our senses. Structures and faces matter less and melt to background. As feelings matter more, the abstract world takes the four. She just said, just repeat after me, just, it's okay. Just learn words from me, a spirit will teach you words. So she was speaking, and I tried to pick up on some of the things she was saying and say them back. So different animals can see different yeah, it's possible. versions of color. Yeah. And aren't there like a bunch of colors we see that... Or that we don't see that exists. Yeah. Though it would, color is just a notion that we've we've subscribed to these these different um, wavelengths of light. How strange that real no longer seems real. If your reality is based on what you've perceived, then if you change that, that perception system, you will, you will be shocked at what you discover and what kind of Kafkaesque world you've been plunged into, where you know, up is down and down is up and left is right and blue is green and, and hot is orange. And but I, I've never revisited that experience in the sense that I've never tried to do it on my own. And I kind of want to because I think that wasn't an accident that I had that experience. And often I think of her saying to me, speak. Who decides what is real?